Prime Nation family, I go on, say it's my peeps, they're back with another video. So I came across a video on TikTok, Rhyme Nation a family, with an individual that speak out against Patrick Allen, which is the Governor General for Jamaica. The man has said, all who are going, the wickedness will take place in Jamaica, he never see Patrick Allen come forward and speak out against all of them things that were happening in Jamaica. You see me? So the man rushed Patrick Allen wicked in a this video rhyme nation family. So right about now, I'm going to make you know, take a look at the video. Leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section and tell me what think. And if this is your first time viewing Rhyme Nation channel, please consider subscribing to the channel as well. And as per usual, my peeps, watch the video to the end. So, a lot of Jamaicans are not aware that the Prime Minister is not the head of this country. It is the Governor General. I'll say it again. The Prime Minister is not really the head of the country. It's the Governor General. The Prime Minister works for the Governor General. Who, of course, him work for Westminster, for England, for the King. The Governor General can get up tomorrow and do something that is known as dissolve the parliament. Him can just fire everybody and dissolve the parliament. We don't hear nothing from Patrick Allen. We don't hear nothing from Patrick Allen. And Patrick Allen, for you to be a pastor, a trained pastor, who was once the union president for the Seventh-day Adventist Church, you supposed to be a man of God. <laughs> you are awfully quiet on every single episode of what parliamentarians been doing to the Jamaican people. The level of corruption in the country. You, Patrick Allen. You are being chauffeur driven. You and all of them. All I know. Been chauffeur driven right across this country. On a sleep in some big old king size bed. See the pastor peeding mattress. But fine. Sheet on eat probably all four square meal per day. Too much on half the abundance of one half. Patrick Allen, you are too quiet. I'm a sick and tired of Uno play with the Jamaican people. Them. People are out here suffering. People are out here being robbed and raped and abused and killed and kidnapped. Thousands of Jamaicans. Some of them not even know. Check the records. Over 2,000 Jamaicans go missing every year. From a little, little country with 3 million people. 2,000 people is a lot of people to go missing every year. And we don't see that as alarming. I wonder where they go. Let me tell you this. Somebody has to represent the people in my Jamaica. Yeah? Somebody has to say enough is enough. Who think you going to kill Marcus Gavin and Joe? So who don't think so don't get rid of Nelson Mandela? Who don't think so who don't get rid of all the men and women who fought for black people's independence? Who stood up against injustices? Who stood up against foreign people, foreign entities who meddles, who has been meddling 
connections and how we do things down here. We do things on the kind kill all of the prophets them and the patriots. Well, one left. See me? Don't tell it already. One of the worst man to exist is a man who doesn't have backbone and who is scared of death. We live once, we die once. How we die is very important. My plan, my plan, for fight for the Jamaican people up to the dead. We have thousands of our young men, of our young men in prison out here. Enough of the youth step in a prison. They were not supposed to be there. Some of them, the system push them for do things for them name for do and they are there and for them to sit in prison right now not for the youth them in a prison left them kids and left them their woman and their mother and their father right now not for them sit down in there and them watch how politicians do we out here and the heinous crimes committed by politicians and for those politicians still out here and enjoy three square meal per day and I enjoy everything everything and a beard in a nice pretty bathroom with hot and cold water while Jamaican communities still without water and people still are defecate a bush the police them up for Moko Moko police them not even have a bathroom they not even have water not even water the man them not have up there not even water the men and women or service men and women from Upper Mokwa police station I mean I'll stop talking about it hmm? but you Patrick Allen you the governor general nobody not take your hand everybody free that one up you still up there collect how much how much millions a year you <laughs> not do nothing you <laughs> not do a goddamn thing you eh? not do nothing For yourself. Is it the same God that you preached about for years? You, Patrick Allen. Is it the same God you want to know? Remember, me tell you, say, you see, any day, any day, you ain't ready for no. <laughs> You're going to think it's literally the end of the world. I want God to beat you. God more have to do it. Man can't do them a kind of beat. God more have to do it. I would love for God to really show up. Beat you, man. I'm cruel. I'm not wicked to the Jamaican people. I'm not wicked. I'm not wicked. Trust me.